we first start by looking at the effect of vinegar on plain table salt. There's no immediate uh, visible reaction and when you look at the site there are no bubbles um, appearing to appear to be formed and um, even after a period of time um, there's no reaction that is apparent. Next we move on to cure one and cures number two, um, both with um, distilled vinegar. We had the vinegar to cure number one. Initially, we see no visible reaction. We give it a shake. No immediate um, visible reaction. So we add the vinegar to cure two. At this point, all you can smell coming from the glasses is the smell of the vinegar itself. We've now left it for a minute or so. No noticeable smell other than the vinegar. Now we give it another shake and you see it's taken a while but we are starting to see some bubbles coming from the liquid and there's a very faint smell which is over and above the vinegar but it's very faint and the more you agitate you see the very fine bubbles so now we do the cure with um, liquid smoke, which is reported to um, be very acidic. Add the liquid smoke, and immediately it looks like an espresso coffee, where we are seeing um, a foam forming on the top of the cure. It looks as if with the liquid smoke we are getting a stronger reaction than we got with the vinegar. Now we add the liquid smoke to cure number two. And again, we get the frothing on the top. Um, it's difficult to tell whether there's any more reaction than with the vinegar, or whether the liquid smoke is just allowing the bubbles to form a froth which is being held. But it's de there is a definite reaction. Again, there's a very faint smell which is above and beyond the liquid smoke. And here we are repeating the experiment with 10% vinegar. Add the liquid to cure number one. 
No visible reaction. In New York a short time ago, the Dow Jones was up 131 points at 18,626. Unlike the neat vinegar, we don't start to get any small bubbles um, coming to the surface even when we tap and shake. Even after five minutes of leaving it in the glass, um, we still didn't see any visible signs of reaction. That obviously doesn't mean to say there isn't a reaction, it just means that the reaction isn't liberating um, sufficient um, gas to be visible. No obvious signs of any reaction at all, including no smell being given off other than the smell of the dilute vinegar. Here we try the liquid smoke just in the salt to see whether we get the same frothing as we got with the cures. And this would indicate whether the cures were actually causing a reaction. The liquid smoke directly onto the, the plain table salt. We don't get the frothing in the same way as we did with adding the liquid smoke to the cures. Well, after all that time, you decided that you're spending too much time at least and not enough time in stocking.